what a joy it is to see a young couple kind of Christ as their Lord and Savior. And I met Daniel a couple of years ago, I guess, wasn't it? And Nathan met him here in the last year, and uh, we went to Israel in the last week, and they uh, both said they wanted to know more about the Lord, and they want to get closer to them. And we talked about their salvation. And, uh, both of them were coming this morning uh, as a public profession of their faith. And the Lord Jesus Christ is their Savior and sacrificed it from the cross. And they really recognized that only Christ's blood can make it right. Daniel, if you accept the Christ as your Lord and Savior and ask forgiveness of your sins, I baptize you as my brother in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Very good to dance. Caitlin, if you receive Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior and ask Him to forgive you your sins, yes. I baptize you as my sister in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. We're very good in baptism. desires to know more about him and grow closer to him. You know, at the pool of Siloam, there was an instance, there's an instance in the scripture in which a man was uh, debilitated. And he was unable to get down into the water as the angel came and served the waters. Jesus' disciples came by. And that man from that day forward was healed. He was healed. You know what Christ did on Calvary's cross when He shed His blood for our sins? He presented that healing power, that saving power, that is able to grant eternal life. We are so glad that You've chosen to be with us here today at Oakland Baptist Church to witness uh, this young couple being baptized into the church. And uh, my, my question to you is, how is your relationship with the Lord? Do you know Him as your Lord and Savior?